In this example, uh, we're given a point uh, or the coordinates for a point on the graph of a one-to-one -one function named g. So because g is a one-to-one -one function, that means it has an inverse function. And what we want to do is find a point on the graph of uh, this inverse function, uh, g inverse. So one way to think about uh, the inverse of a function is it uh, switches, it interchanges uh, the input and the output quantities. So if um, the point minus 2 minus 7 um, is on the graph of the function g, then if we interchange uh, the input uh, and the output coordinates uh, in this point, uh, that point is going to be on the graph of uh, the inverse function. So we know that minus 7 and minus 2, the point we get by interchanging these two uh, coordinates, uh, is going to be a point on the graph um, of the inverse function uh, for g, um, labeled as uh, g inverse, or g with the superscript of minus 1.